The Lexus driver runs a red, ramming into the camera head on. The camera is battling this out with insurance companies, but it's clear that he's not at fault. The camera has a great channel too. The camera caught this SUV driver running a red causing the oncoming truck to T-bone him totaling both vehicles. It's a miracle that there were no serious injuries reported. Camera was going way too fast given the current conditions resulting in him spinning out of control and crashing. Proper tires and driving with extra caution on these types of roads is crucial. The silver SUV driver failed to yield to the camera, resulting in this collision. Thanks to dash cam footage, the SUV driver was at fault. I saw this on Reddit from Yoshio Mitsu. This YouTuber was taking matters into his own hands to protest the DMR in Call of Duty Warzone. Do I have any Call of Duty Warzone fans that are fed up with the DMR2? Let me know down below. The camera admits that this was his fault and he should have been more alert behind the wheel. The turning driver failed to yield to oncoming traffic, resulting in this crash. The airbags were deployed as a result of both vehicles being totaled. There were no injuries reported. The oncoming Chevy driver illegally overtook, resulting in them clipping the camera's Tesla. The camera is currently dealing with insurance. The camera was a victim of a hit and run. The camera did the right thing by not pursuing, but calling 911 and his insurance. It can be very dangerous to pursue a hit and runner. UPS claims that after an investigation, the brakes seemingly malfunctioned on this truck, resulting in it rolling downwards and crashing into multiple vehicles. Thankfully, no one was injured. I agree with what the camera did here. The oblivious oncoming driver overtook illegally. Had the camera not had quick reflexes and swerved and hit the ditch, it would have been a potentially fatal head-on collision with the other car. This driver ran a red and was very lucky he didn't get nailed by the box truck. He drifted and made a pretty impressive save not crashing with anyone. If I were him, I'd play the lottery that day. Insurance is still ruling on this accident. Who do you think will be at fault? The camera, the other driver, or do you think it'll be split 50-50?
Somehow the Corvette lost control, spun out, and slammed into the barrier. What do you think happened here? Let me know your thoughts down below. The driver behind the camera was distracted ramming into his car totaling both vehicles. Thankfully, there were no serious injuries reported. The truck driver had a last second urge to get a nice juicy patty melt from Whataburger causing the camera to ram into him. Patty melts are delicious, but not that delicious to crash over. On a side note, what's your favorite item from Whataburger? lost control of his SUV and fought the ABS all the way down until he hit the patch of snow. He's now dealing with a repair shop. As always, extra caution on icy and snowy roads is key. Volkswagen driver blindly merged into the camera's lane, sideswiping his vehicle. Thanks to dashcam footage, the Volkswagen driver would be at fault. The following Bambi clip may not be suitable to all viewers. If you'd like to skip it, please fast forward 45 seconds from now. was being stubborn and forced his way into the lane, but at the same time too, the truck driver wouldn't have lost anything by just letting him in. The officers that arrived allegedly cited both drivers. Do you agree with the actions of the officers? Let me know your thoughts.